morning folks, Ari here from Direct Auto Outlet in Fair Oaks, California. I've got this gorgeous 2013 Toyota Prius for you today and this will be a test drive and driving impression video of this vehicle where we'll be getting this vehicle on the road, putting it through its paces and taking you along with us for the ride so you can see and hear everything we see in here. We do have an in-depth walk around video of this vehicle that we've done as well where we go inside and demonstrate as many functions and features and just give you a general overview of the vehicle so make sure you check that video out as well. Links to both videos are in the description portion of the ad anywhere you see this vehicle for sale. Without further ado, please join us. We'll go for a test drive. First and foremost, I do want to point out this vehicle does come with both of its original key fobs. Those things do cost a small fortune, so it's definitely important that those are included. The flashing you see on your screen there is an optical illusion. You're not going to see that in real life. It's just the exposure and flash rate of the camera versus the lens on uh, what that LCD screen uh, transmits. You're not going to see it flashing in real life with your naked eye. Air conditioning is blowing nice and cold. Go ahead and put the vehicle into drive. Nice cold AC on a warm, hot day. 166,283 miles. These Priuses do a lot of things really well. Um, they're extremely roomy inside as I was uh, mentioning in the walk around video I am six foot two and I have the seat adjusted to my position the driver's seat and then I can sit behind myself in the rear seat and still not hit my knee on the back side of the driver's seat it's extremely roomy on the interior and extremely comfortable the vehicle ride is also very smooth and quiet and forgiving plus you know Let's not uh, forget the elephant in the room, 50 miles per gallon. Folks, you can get 50 miles per gallon in this vehicle, and many owners of Priuses actually report in the forums getting in excess of 65 or even 70 if you're conscious of how you're driving and uh, you modify how quickly you accelerate and decelerate. It's no wonder why so many people use these as Ubers and Lyfts and taxis and drive them around the clock. They're high build quality, reliability, longevity, great resale value, uh, but also fuel economy. Again, very impressive. Another thing that these do really well is uh, trunk space, cabin space, interior space. Um, that hatchback in the rear is extremely roomy, especially when you lay the seats down. You get very large items back there with very little trouble. As we stomp on our brakes here, I don't feel any shaking on the vehicle, no shaking on the chassis of the vehicle, no shaking on the pedal or steering wheel, nothing that would uh, indicate any warpage of the brakes or rotors. Uh, vehicle is riding very smooth and very quiet. And as we go through these twists and turns, it does invoke a lot of confidence in the driver. The vehicle handles very well, it doesn't lean on the turns, it feels nice and stable and stout. quiet and comfortable. I believe the pearl white exterior paint on this is probably the color that suits this vehicle the best. Not only will it keep you nice and cool in hot temperatures and in the summer, but it's a beautiful color. It's a pearlescent white, three-stage paint, and it goes really nicely along with the black moldings and the mud bumper trim on the vehicle. Everything comes together very nicely. Folks, a vehicle like this can uh, save you so much in fuel that it'll literally pay for itself in just a few short years of ownership. So these are one of the biggest no-brainers in the history of mankind. As we make a right turn onto this next street, this next street is known for having lots of potholes, uneven, rough surfaces, and uh, it's your hard California tax dollars at work here. <laughs> one of our viewers actually mentioned he loves it when I say that. Uh, but it's true. We pay all these fuel taxes and taxes in general in California, and we have some of the worst roads on the road. Worst roads on the road, no pun intended there. But uh, this Prius is handling these rough roads like a champ. Very smooth, I don't feel any rattles, don't feel any squeaks, don't feel any looseness in the suspension. Everything is nice and tight. power mode, which all that really does is just makes your accelerator pedal just a little bit more sensitive. But we'll do a 0 to 60 run. I know these LCD screens are always tricky, but uh, I don't know if you at home can see the 
miles per hour there. I think you can. Do a zero to 60 run going up a hill with the AC blasting. Without further ado, let's get started. really make it get there any quicker from zero to 60 it's just gonna make your accelerator pedal feel uh, feel more responsive but if you're flooring it like I almost did right there it's really gonna mean no difference at all even if you had it in uh, normal mode it would have the same zero to 60 time but again very impressive for a, for a hybrid definitely a vehicle that can get out of its own way many of you may have never driven one of these and just seen people driving them on the road going extremely slow and being obnoxious but uh, that's not due to the car it's actually just due to the driver they're probably just trying to hyper mile and get that 60 to 65 miles per gallon that you can easily achieve if you just pay a little bit more attention to how quickly you're accelerating or decelerating also the speed on the freeway you take will have a great bearing on your mpgs as well Going 65 miles per hour going versus 85 miles per hour makes a huge difference in your MPGs. And that's what kills the miles per gallon on many of these hybrids is when folks are going really fast on the freeway. Hybrids love stop and go driving because they have the regenerative braking and the ch batteries charge up as you're braking and come into a stop. So city driving is no problem. That's really where they're at home. So if you have a commute or you're doing lots of uh, city driving or stop and go freeway driving uh, hybrids are ideal for that you'll get a lot of electric miles out of them doing it that way and uh, my overall thoughts on this vehicle are very very positive I think uh, it's a nice example of this vehicle and it runs very smooth and it's very quiet and does everything it's supposed to do quite well Folks, if you've enjoyed this video, please do consider giving us a thumbs up and also subscribing to our channel. We really are concentrating on our YouTube channel. Cannot grow it without your help. So please help us out and subscribe. And if you do so, make sure you also hit the bell notification icon. First thing we do when we get a vehicle in stock, take some photos of it, do two videos, a walk around video and then a test drive video like the one you're watching right now. And we put it online and it goes live before you see the vehicle anywhere else. So if you're in the market for a new vehicle or just enjoy our videos, see all of our new images inventory first by subscribing hitting the bell notification icon and finding us on YouTube. Folks, if you have any questions or comments, you can leave them in the comment section below or you can just give us a call directly here at the lot at any time at area code 916-765-7575. You can also find us 24-7, 365 days a year online at www.directautooutlet.com want to take this opportunity and thanking you for investing your valuable time and joining us throughout the entirety of this video we certainly do hope to have the opportunity to see and interact with each and every one of you in the near future thank you so much for joining us we'll go ahead and back into our parking spot throw the vehicle into reverse and we'll go ahead and wrap up our video thanks for joining us folks we appreciate it have a wonderful day and to put it in park just hit that button and you are all set thank you everyone have a great day bye, -bye.